Hey, 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 it's your girl Stacy, and it's time for the weekend vlog. So, I finally got some quiet time in my home where I can get through these products that I have to show you guys. I'll probably end up doing two vlogs this week because I posted like a Ask Stacy like kind of forum. So, if you any of you all have questions, you can put it in the comments below. Any kind of questions you want to ask me work related, um, you know, personal advice type stuff, put it in your comments below and I'll definitely get to it um, and answer those. I have a couple of questions on my Facebook page, so I wanted to open it up for YouTube as well. So this one might go a little long, so let me get started. The majority of this stuff is health and beauty, um, but maybe two things that aren't. So. I'm going to try to zip through these real fast. And um, again, if you have questions about any of the stuff, <laughs> hit me down below. And so if you're interested and want to see what I like this couple of months and what I recommend, please continue watching. If not, you might want to log off now. All right, so first I want to start with perfume. So I always like to get one scent and that'll be my signature scent I like fresh clean scents and the one that I have found for this summer well first of before I say that I love uh, light blue by Dolce & Gabbana and I plan to get some more of that I just have been dragging my feet but in the meantime I found this scent and I love it I'm not even going to try to pronounce it because <laughs> French is not my thing, but it's by Lancome, and this is a great summer scent, um, and I love it, and I've been wearing it every day. I get lots of compliments on it. It's very clean smelling, and that's why I like it. Speaking of clean, in my birch box, I got Clean Blossom Sample, and it's a very... Like it says, clean, fresh scent. I do, um, I have worn it a couple times, but then I found my Lancome scent and I've kind of put the others to the side. All right. Um, let me, what do I want to do next? Let's go with this. So I know you guys have heard a, a lot about the Argon, 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 however, oil of Morocco. Um, and of course, I'm still using the bottle, but this is the packaging. Got this from CVS. Um, I've been told it will help with humidity. As you can see, I got the curls going on because my hair with this humidity was just getting really bleh. So I went and got my hair done yesterday, and I asked my beautician to just roller set it for me so it'll fall in the humidity um, and I can manage it better. But I've been told to put this on, and this will help with it. So far, so good. I like the way it smells. Again, it's a light oil. Don't use too much. And I'll let you know once I'm done. But so far, I like it. I've mentioned to you guys the lip therapies, the Vaseline lip therapies. And I'm both out of both of these. But these were good. Um, this one has a red tint to it. This one does not. Um, but they were both. I like both of them. I like to keep them on my nightstands and by my um, little remote caddy in my living room so I need to re-up on these but I recommend these by Vaseline um, this was just like a healing salve it's uh, TNCA no TNC ap apothecary apothecary I'm not sure how you say it um, at gmail.com is where you can find this I'll see, let me flip it around for you you can see that. Um, my friends and I did a product swap. Um, and this was one of the products my friend had. And I took it from her because she didn't want it. But I used it on like, um, see if I can show it, like that scar I have. I put it on the scar to help heal it. Um, my elbows have a little eczema. Good stuff. Um, this was another item I got from my girlfriend during our product swap. Shout out to Joy. It's a mandarin body butter uh, sample. Very good. Again, you can go to this website to probably reorder it. I won't be doing that, but I enjoyed it while I had it. It was good stuff. 
I just have enough body stuff. So speaking of, <coughs> excuse me, here's my favorite by Perfectly Posh. I have one left. I need to order another one. Amazing, fat, big fat, yummy hand cream. Love this. This is my favorite scent of all. So I will be ordering this again. I recommend if you don't have a um, perfectly posh rep, let me know. Inbox me and I will give you my my reps information. Okay? Woohoo! Another perfectly posh sample that I got. I have one more to use. Honey, honey, good stuff. This is a hand cream um, as well. It's like a honey lemon scent. It, it smells good, feels good. I like it, but amazing is still my favorite. Okay, um, in my birch box, I got um, a brow volumizer gel. And it was in a light brown. It's called Gimme Brow. Wasn't really my color, a little too light for me, but it just makes your brows look thicker. I have another product by Maybelline, both of them by Maybelline that I use. But if it would have been the right color, I would have used it. It just was a little too light for me. Okay, um, going on with the bath. I love Dove. Like, um, it's just a, a clean, um, mild body wash and soap. I try. I like the regular plain in the blue box white bottle, uh, white Dove. But I went on and used the. Uh, Cooling cucumber, or what's it called? Cool moisture. Uh, I thought it had some of the. What's it called? It just says go fresh, but it has a cucumber um, scent to it. Cucumber mint, maybe. I don't know what that little leaf is. But anyway, it's green. And I like it. Um, it smells good. I just wanted a couple of bars of soap. Sometimes I get tired of washing. I want a soap. So this is what I use. I liked it. I have one bar left, and I will be repurchasing. Um, I mentioned to you guys a couple of vlogs ago that I used the Shiseido cotton swabs or cotton squares, but then I mentioned that I also had some CVS that worked just as well. Well, I'm out of those, but they were the CVS cotton ovals. Very good. They serve the same purpose, taking off makeup, um, putting on Neosporin, uh, what else did I use it for? Um, wiping off stuff, um, when I would get my brows done, you know, taking the alcohol swab and just cleaning my eyebrows up. And then I also had the cotton facial pads. They were good as well. Out of those. Um, CVS had, um, some razors on sale and I got them. They were the two blades. I prefer Daisy. These were, I guess, the generic Daisy. To me, they didn't shave as well. But, I mean, if you need a razor in a, in a tight, this will work. But stick with the name brand to me with the razors. I needed something, not so much with this hair, hairstyle, but my other hairstyle that I could tie down. Because my other um, head wrap had gotten messed up. So I went and got this. And it was okay. Um, it kind of moved a little too much for me. And it left that line in the back of my head. Um, maybe I had it too tight. I don't know. But I still have it, but I don't use it as much anymore. Now, what I do use and what I do love and what I do recommend all us curvy girls, and even us girls that aren't curvy, sometimes we don't need to see every line, bump, dimple, ripple, Get you some Spanx. Um, let me see. I don't need y'all seeing what sides I wear. So, let me peel the sides off real quick. Oh, I just hold it like this. So, anyway, this was the Spanx High Power Panty. And um, I don't like the girdle thing. I don't have big legs. But I do have a little um, fluffiness in my midsection. So, this helps hold me in. It also prevents the panty lines and just makes me look smooth. A lot of times, women go wrong because we don't have the right um, undergarments or, you know, underwear. And when I say underwear, I'm not just talking panties and bra. I'm talking like undergarment wear 
spanks, hold me tights as I call them, whatever, to make us just look smooth and well put together. So invest in your, um, you know, some good body, what do you call it, y'all? Shape Body shapers, um, shapewear, shapewear. Invest in some good shapewear. I have two spanks now and I need to get one more just so I'd like to not wear one out all the time. All right, and then I have my Crest Pro Health Advanced Toothpaste Sample that I got from my dentist. Again, I've told y'all this before. I am a Colgate girl, but this is good. I get these when I go to my dentist and I take them when I go traveling. They're good travel size toothpaste and you don't have to go buy them at the store. Last but not least, um, prenatal vitamin CVS. I find that they do just as well as your one a day and, or any other vitamins. Nat, was it Nature's Choice? These work just as well and they're cheaper. I'm not expecting. It's just a good vitamin. It's a multivitamin for women of my age. Um, and my doctor recommended years ago till I basically hit menopause to use these prenatal vitamins and so far so good especially working at a new place you know you have new germs so I'm trying to ward off any kind of colds and stuff like that and so far so good knock on wood and now to the three items that aren't uh, work um, bath and body related so I got a pop socket and I got this idea from my girl Keiko Beauty I follow her on YouTube and Instagram and what it is is just a little adhesive that adheres to your phone and you can hold it you can prop it up and you know like say like this and watch movies I love it I thought it was so fun funny when she mentioned it, I was like what is that thing but when I saw it then I said let me try it I love it and I get a lot of compliments of people like what is that oh I need one of those ten dollars y'all popsocket.com See? All right. Um, Swiffer dusters. I've mentioned these. I love these. I use ceiling fans a lot, which generates a lot of dust. And I also have little Caesar, and so he has pet dander. So to have these dusters is really good. I know you all have seen the commercials. I'm actually leaving when I finish this filming this and going to get a refill. I'm out. So. Again, I highly recommend the Swiffer, Swiffer dusters and the wet mop. Last but not least, I've actually tried another one since I've had this and didn't get to show. This stuff is good. <coughs> my job, um, by my job, the little deli sells another one with like pot, uh, potato chips. And then there's one with bacon in it. So it gives you that great salty sweet mix hold on somebody insisted they go outside and now they got too hot hold on Come on in, see. I told you it was hot out there all right so like I was saying this is some great chocolate this one of course is the um, caramel apple so you know it's just sweet like it tastes like a caramel apple but the other three I mentioned with the bacon and the um, potato chips give you the perfect sweet and salty so I recommend those so that's all I have guys I know this went a little long but if you have any questions about any of the products um, feel free to comment below if you have any questions that you want me to answer in my next vlog also please comment below until I talk to you later have a great week have a blessed week and I'll holla